So we go and we get out there and geez, it was the butteriest day. The winds were so perfect. Zach got a couple sick ones with nobody out. And when I finally got out there and got my first wave, I didn't know what to expect. It was like this new frontier. And yeah, the first wave is always the best one because you realize it's all performance from there on. You know, you get out of your head and you get into your feet, you get into the speed, you get into the feeling and you're surfing. You're no longer playing mind games on yourself. And what I realized eventually after a couple waves was it's still just surfing. Something I've done for almost 30 years. I need to look at it like that. I need to approach it from what I've learned my whole life and just let it happen. I really wanted to just feel it out, stay as humble as possible. I definitely wasn't going out saying, you know, I'm gonna go catch the biggest wave of the day today. I was like, you know, if I catch a good size one, I'm lucky. I caught a wave that big until I saw the photo like two weeks later because you're catching them and going you know you're not looking back trying to trying to figure out oh okay wow, let me let me scale this one oh, that's a 20 footer no just going and for me I had no idea how big the waves were that I was on and just knew that you're gonna ride them and stay safe 